An ideology is a set of beliefs, values, and principles that shape the way individuals and groups view the world and make decisions about how to act within it. Ideologies often provide a framework for understanding social, economic, and political issues, and they can be used to justify particular courses of action or to criticize others. Some examples of ideologies include liberalism, conservatism, socialism, fascism, and feminism. Ideologies can be deeply ingrained in individual and collective identities and can play a significant role in shaping cultural and political discourse. There are many ideologies, each with its own set of beliefs, values, and principles. Here are some of the most prominent ideologies. Liberalism emphasizes individual liberty, free markets, and limited government intervention in economic and social affairs. Conservatism favors traditional values and institutions, individual responsibility, and limited government intervention in economic and social affairs. Socialism advocates for collective ownership of the means of production and the distribution of resources according to need. Communism, a form of socialism that seeks to establish a classless society in which all property and resources are collectively owned and controlled. Fascism, emphasizes extreme nationalism, authoritarianism, and the supremacy of the state over individual rights. Anarchism, opposes all forms of government and authority, advocating instead for a society based on voluntary cooperation and mutual aid. Environmentalism, prioritizes the protection of the natural world and emphasizes sustainability and conservation. Feminism, advocates for gender equality and the dismantling of patriarchal systems of power. Libertarianism, emphasizes individual liberty and minimal government intervention in all aspects of life, including economics, social affairs, and personal freedoms. Nationalism, prioritizes the interests and culture of one's nation over those of other nations, often emphasizing the need for a strong national identity and unity. It's important to note that these ideologies are not mutually exclusive and can intersect and overlap in various ways. Ideologies are diverse and range from the conventional to the unconventional. Here are some of the more unusual or unconventional ideologies. Objectivism, a philosophy created by Ayn Rand that emphasizes individualism, reason, and capitalism. It rejects altruism and holds that individuals should act in their own self-interest. Technogionism, an ideology that advocates for the use of technology to mitigate environmental damage caused by a human activity. Transhumanism, a philosophy that seeks to enhance human physical and cognitive abilities through the use of technology. Pastafarian, a satirical religion that worships the flying spaghetti monster and promotes the idea that belief in any deity is equally valid. Discordianism, a parody religion that promotes chaos and disorder as a means of spiritual enlightenment. Solipsism, a philosophical theory that holds that the self is the only thing that can be known or verified to exist and that everything else is a product of one's own mind. Ageism, an anarchist philosophy that advocates for the use of black and gray markets as a means of achieving a stateless society. Transcendental meditation, a spiritual practice that involves the repetition of a mantra to achieve a state of deep relaxation and transcendence. Libertarian municipalism, an anarchist philosophy that advocates for the establishment of decentralized, self-governing municipalities. Accelerationism, an ideology that advocates for the acceleration of social and technological change as a means of creating a post-capitalist society. Ideology can have a significant impact on economic policy and practice. Different ideologies can lead to different approaches to economic issues, such as taxation, government regulation, and income distribution. Here are some examples. Liberalism, liberal economic ideology emphasizes the importance of free markets and private property. Liberals believe that economic growth is best achieved through free trade, competition, and entrepreneurship, and they tend to favor limited government intervention in the economy. Conservatism, conservative economic ideology often emphasizes the importance of traditional values, limited government, and individual responsibility. Conservatives tend to favor lower taxes, reduced government spending, and a smaller role for government in the economy. Socialism. Socialist ideology emphasizes collective ownership of the means of production and the redistribution of wealth to reduce economic inequality. Socialists often advocate for government intervention in the economy to regulate prices, control monopolies, and ensure that everyone has access to basic necessities. Communism 
communist ideology advocates for the abolition of private property and the establishment of a classless society. In a communist system, the state owns and controls all means of production, and resources are distributed according to need. Environmentalism, environmental ideology prioritizes the protection of the natural world and emphasizes sustainability and conservation. This can influence economic policy by promoting the use of renewable energy sources, reducing waste, and encouraging businesses to adopt environmentally sustainable practices. Ideological differences can often lead to debates and disagreements about economic policy, with different groups advocating for different approaches to economic issues. For example, debates between advocates of free market capitalism and advocates of more interventionist economic policies, such as Keynesianism or socialism, are common in many countries. Ideology can have a significant impact on human progress, as it shapes the way individuals and societies view and approach various issues related to social, economic, and political progress. Here are some ways in which ideology can affect human progress. Ideology can shape our understanding of what progress means, different ideologies have different ideas about what progress means and how it can be achieved. For example, some ideologies may prioritize economic growth and technological advancement, while others may prioritize social justice and equality. Ideology can influence policy decisions, governments often base their policies on ideological beliefs. For example, a government that prioritizes individual freedom may have policies that emphasize deregulation and reducing government intervention in the economy, while a government that prioritizes social justice may have policies that emphasize income redistribution and increased social spending. Ideology can shape societal values and norms. Ideologies can shape societal values and norms, influencing what people consider to be desirable or unacceptable behavior. For example, an ideology that emphasizes individualism and competition may lead to a society that values material success and competition, while an ideology that emphasizes community and cooperation may lead to a society that values cooperation and social responsibility. Ideology can influence technological development. Ideologies can shape the direction of technological development. For example, an ideology that emphasizes environmental sustainability may lead to the development of renewable energy sources while an ideology that emphasizes economic growth and efficiency may lead to the development of more automation and technological innovations that increase productivity. In summary, ideologies can have a significant impact on human progress by shaping our understanding of progress, influencing policy decisions, shaping societal values and norms, and influencing technological development. It is difficult to imagine a world without any ideologies or belief systems as they are an inherent part of human nature and human societies. Ideologies help people make sense of the world around them, provide a sense of meaning and purpose, and shape our beliefs, values, and behavior. However, it is possible to imagine a world where ideologies play a less dominant role in human affairs. In such a world, people may be more open to diverse perspectives and more willing to engage in critical thinking and inquiry. They may be more focused on finding practical solutions to problems, rather than promoting a particular ideology or belief system. There may be greater emphasis on evidence-based decision-making and collaboration, rather than ideological or partisan divides. It is also worth noting that some aspects of human life may be less affected by ideology than others. For example, scientific inquiry and technological development may be less influenced by ideology, as they are often guided by empirical evidence and practical considerations rather than ideological beliefs. In conclusion, while it is difficult to imagine a world without ideologies, it is possible to imagine a world where they play a less dominant role in human affairs. Such a world may be characterized by greater openness, critical thinking, evidence-based decision-making, and collaboration.